Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm bringing you a homeware haul. I've been shopping in Home Bargains and B&M over the past couple of months, collecting things for the flat since we've moved in. So I thought I'd just show you quite a few things that I've been buying over that time. It might be quite a long haul because I've been low-key obsessed with Home Bargains and B&M, so I've bought quite a lot of stuff. And I've managed to collect quite a few things that were going to sell out really quickly as well because I sort of traveled to quite a few different home bargains over the last couple of months such as Whitstable, Colchester, where else? Lakeside. I've been going around quite a few home bargains because I absolutely love it. Yeah, help me. I'll get straight into the haul. I've gone to home bargains and B&M for a lot of soft furnishings to make it feel really homely. One of the first items I bought was this lantern which is so nice and actually you can put it anywhere because it's battery operated. So I think I bought this for about six or seven pounds. Next I I bought this succulent. This was it's a fake succulent from Home Bargains and I believe it was about three pound or something. It just goes really well with our bathroom decor and I really love it. I just love the, the theme of it. On the theme of plants, I also got this. I just think this is a really nice design and it sort of matches the other things that I've bought as well. It's sort of like sand, sandy foam and then some succulent parts on the top. And I put that on next to the TV. So I also bought another succulent plant, shock. <laughs> I kind of went mad for succulent plants, I can't lie. This had like a nice gold bowl with it. And the reason I bought this is because I bought the mirror tray. So I bought this mirror tray to go on our coffee table and I thought this succulent plant went really well with it just to put it on top. And I just really love the way that looks. So that is what I do. And I also put a couple of candles on it and we light that in the evening and it's just super cute and really warming. I then bought one of these really large orchids from Home Bargains as well. I believe this was about six pound, which I think is actually unreal because a lot of the time fake orchids that are this size are really expensive, like at least 20 pound up. And I got this to go in our bedroom and I just think it looks really nice and really classy. And still on the home bargains hype with plants, got this and I don't think this is gonna fit in the camera, but this is, this is sort of like a grass plant that it stands really tall in the front room and it looks really edgy. So that's the sort of grass plant and then it rests in this gold frame, which is really nice. Yeah, that goes on next to our console table. So that's all the plants from Home Bargains, but still on the sort of decor side of things. We got this uh, metal framed circle that goes on our wall. Um, and I really just like the the style of this. Oh, I've got some fluff caught on me. I put two little succulent plants that I bought from Aldi on here and I just think it looks really nice and it just gives a really nice look to the room. And as you can probably tell, I've gone through like a lot of like black metal in the in the theme of our flat and I just think it looks really nice. How many times do I want to say it looks really nice? Another thing that I got from Home Bargains is a window mirror. Um, I actually bought two of these window mirrors and as you can see behind me, there's one on the wall there. I think this was there's such a steal. Window mirrors are really in at the moment. I really like window mirrors. I love the way they look. This flat is particularly small in size, so to open it up a bit and get a little bit of light reflecting around the room, um, I thought it'd be a good idea to get a couple of mirrors uh, to put on the walls and it works really well. So that one also from Home Bargains and then this one just sits behind where my behind my head and they both sit together and it just it just looks lovely. These were seven or eight pound which which again, it is such a bargain. So Home Bargains is really living up to its name. I feel like things sell out really quickly in Home Bargains. And the other thing I found is only some stores will sell certain items. Not all stores will sell everything. So it's really hard to find the certain things that you want, especially when you see them on their, their Instagram or something, which I definitely do. I knew that they were selling some duck feather pillows and we managed to get hold of some in one of the stores. This one is duck filled and it's emerald green, which I think goes really well with black and gold. Because they're duck filled, I'm able to karate chop them, which I absolutely love. I'll karate chop them on the bed. So they just go on the bed as a little feature and I just think it's so nice. You can't, you can't karate chop pillows without duck feathers. So that was a steal and they're like six pound each. So I've been eyeing up chunky knit throws for 
so long. I always found that when you looked online for a chunky knit throw, they were like sort of 60, 50, 60 pound. Um, so I was always hesitant to get one, but Home Bargain started doing chunky knit throws and I managed to get my hand on a gray one, which is great. And they're 25 pounds. So yeah, love this. And it goes on our swivel chair in the front room, which is lovely. Um, I got these over door hooks. I'm planning to just put these over our new wooden doors because we don't want to actually damage the doors themselves by drilling holes in. So these are really good just to hang over the door. So I've also bought some black velvet hangers and I've bought enough now so that all of my clothes are hung on these hangers. I wanted matching hangers because um, I've been watching the home edit and they said that the best thing you can do to organize your wardrobe is to have matching hangers. So that is what I did. So we also bought some pasta bowls from Home Bargains. So they look like this. I'll just get, get one out. I bought two sets of plates from Wilco and they're sort of like an off-white. They're slightly creamy and they didn't do pasta bowls. So we was hunting down for them and shock horror, Home Bargains did the right color pasta bowls for us. So we got four of these. So from B&M, I managed to get this ladder. I'm probably not gonna be able to show you. <laughs> It's almost like a towel rail. Yeah, I really loved it. I saw it in Home, bar um, home Bargains, no. Saw this one in B&M and absolutely loved it. I just love the idea of having towels sort of draped over it. They were being sold in B&M for 12 pounds. So this goes in our bathroom and we just hang a couple of towels on it and it looks really nice. Also from B&M, I bought this other succulent plant and this was obviously fake as well, but it's black and gold. So I couldn't resist picking it up. I still don't know where to put this at the moment. I think it's still gonna go in the second bedroom because we've got a lot of black and gold in the front room and I feel like I'm overdoing it. Finally, onto cleaning stuff. I got these baskets from Home Bargains. These were really nice. We've got three sets of them now and they're all sort of in our kitchen cupboards and in our airing cupboard just to organize lots of different things. I like the fact that they're shallow so you can see everything that's in them but they just keep everything nice and organized. These are the cleaning bits that I bought. I also got some Bin Buddy. I don't know if any of you use Bin Buddy but just makes your bins smell really fresh and keep them fresh for ages. So I also got some pink grapefruit Sephora. I hadn't smelled this one before, but it actually smells really nice. My favorite Sephora though is Linen Fresh. That one is just so lovely. I then got some laundry whitener to keep my laundry fresh and white. I got the pink stuff paste as well. I hadn't used it before, but I'd seen Mrs. Hinch use it and a few other Instagrammers and I wanted to try it out. I have tried it out on a couple of pans and it's sort of like got sand in it. It's really abrasive. Yeah, it's really good for getting off hard and tough stains. And I also used it in the oven as well. So and I got some microfiber cloths because you cannot go wrong with microfiber cloths. And also I bought these um, sink tidy, sink tidies? No, <sighs> what are they called? Fridge organizers. I also bought these fridge drawers from Home Bargains. Now I've bought quite a few and they're in the fridge already so I couldn't be bothered to get them all out. So they come with little labels, um, which I really like. I've been putting these, putting these in the fridge to keep everything nice and organized. Again, this is inspired by the home edit. Yeah. And I also got this little mini lantern from b and I think it was two pound or something silly. It was really cheap, um, but it matches our really large lantern that we've got from the range. For two pound, couldn't really go wrong. So that is my home bargains and B&M haul complete. I hope you've enjoyed it and I hope it's given you some inspo for your own place or your own bedroom. Please like this video if you did and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.